over 20,000 cows to be culled in New Zealand due to Mycoplasma bovis. And the farmers are just going to get bailed out by MPI and they're just going to create new herds, clean herds apparently for the future. Is this really New Zealand's future? I don't think so. Clearly dairy is not good for New Zealand's waterways, it's not good for many many things, greenhouse emissions, your health. It's a shame that it's just going to carry on basically, there's so many reasons to not have cows and have so many cattle on our land, but it's a shame to see that this is happening. And for the cows, obviously the from day one they were born to be killed because they're born just for a purpose, for use, for taste, for for milk that's not intended for humans. But 20,000 just gone, dead. No one gets to see that, no one will see that because it's not pretty, it won't be pretty. Just killing thousands and thousands of cows, so. Spare a thought for the cows that have to be born into this lifestyle, or this life, and just be slaughtered before they're, well before their time's up. And just because, oh, What's caused this disease? Who knows? There's been other cow diseases in the past and I'm sure there'll be more in the future because it's not natural having intensive dairy farms on the land. It doesn't work, clearly. So it's a shame to see that this is happening, like I said. And man, the cows. If you care the slightest bit about animals, then at least have some sympathy and maybe change your ways and no longer contribute to this animal suffering, this perpetual animal suffering by man, by breeding them into existence and killing them for use, for no real use, no real need, no absolute need, not for, you don't need meat to survive, you don't need milk to survive, so consider not buying any milk products or any animal products or any beef or any cow products and let's stop this from happening, let's grow actual food, health food, 